sound check, one, two, three. Sound check, one, two, three. Okay, so I do some quick setting real quick and we proceed to the game. Okay, the final sound check and we go. Okay, the final sound check and we go. Okay, the final sound check and we go. I'm just waiting for the YouTube okay, the response. Final sound check uh -huh. and we go. All right, maybe from time to time I will switch to my YouTube or my Twitch and just check the stream health, but for now I guess we are ready to proceed.
Okay, stop the music. So the last time we finished uh, Clear Sky, was it? Yes. The last time we finished Clear Sky. And now we are going to start with Call of Pripyat. But the funny thing is that I'm actually streaming or on two platforms right now. And let's see how it goes, if it goes super well or not super well. And I checked, I see the chat from both platforms, just in case. But yeah, uh, I tested the game, ran some tests. I actually didn't plan on streaming because I had some plans for today, but some plans changed and here I am. <clears throat> I also wanted to do some new thumbnail for YouTube, but whatever. Let's start a new game <clears throat> and watch the intro. At 0123 on April 26, 1986, the reactor of Power Block 4 of Chernobyl NPP is destroyed following a series of thermal explosions. The resulting radioactive cloud moves across the European part of the USSR, Eastern Europe and Scandinavia, eventually reaching America. The consequences of the disaster are so serious that the government is forced to begin evacuating the residents of nearby towns and villages. A 30-kilometer exclusion zone is created to stop residents from returning to the contaminated area. Despite the disaster, the Chernobyl NPP continues to operate. The existence of a power station, as well as the fact that the area is no longer inhabited, leads the Council of Ministers of the USSR to set up a network of secret laboratories in the exclusion zone. June 11, 2006. The exclusion zone lights up with a flash of blinding light as clouds can be seen evaporating in the sky. After a moment of complete silence, a peal of thunder shakes the ground. Most of the government forces guarding the perimeter are killed instantly. 2008. Scientists are still unable to explain what happened. Rare expeditions into the zone usually end in tragedy. The survivors telling stories of mutated animals with incredible abilities roaming the area. According to various estimates, by 2010, the zone is home to between one and 300 unknown individuals. They call themselves stalkers and make their living by collecting anomalous formations known as artifacts, which they sell for considerable sums of money. 2011. Despite military cordons, the stalker phenomenon is growing in numbers. However, stalkers travel primarily around the zone's edges, with the center remaining terra incognita. The few attempts to penetrate deeper into the zone have all ended in failure. 2012, a stalker called Straylock solves the secret of the brain scorcher, a man-made emitter that had blocked the way to the center of the zone for years. After the brain scorcher is disabled, all stalkers rush for the center of the zone, some in hopes of finding a treasure trove of artifacts, others in search of the wish granter. The government decides to launch a large-scale military operation. Operation Fairway, as it came to be known, involves using maps of anomaly fields to maneuver helicopters to the CNPP. Despite meticulous preparation, the operation is a failure, and none of the helicopters return from the mission. Major Dektarev, a USS special agent is sent into the zone to investigate the disappearance of the helicopters. Disguised as a stalker, equipped with a regular assault rifle, two weeks worth of supplies and a radio to communicate with HQ, the Major begins his journey towards the center of the zone. Plop! <laughs> and he just appeared like that. Let me check something real quick. Just want to see how the stream is doing.
Okay, it seems to be doing just it fine. Just like Funny how uh, how I solved the problem, and now I constantly see my window on the stream, even when I uh, minimize it and switch to a different window. It's crazy. Well, was always such a problem for me. But yeah, uh, where are we? Mm -hmm. Here we are. Do we have a detector? Yes, we do, but a very shitty one, actually. And some kicked gear. Done, done. Oh, nice. Twitch just sent me a notification says that I can control my stream with a mobile phone. Didn't know that. There should be a group of stalkers nearby. And our tasks are Stingray 3, investigate the crash site. Stingray 1, Stingray 4, 5. Uh -huh. There should be a group of stalkers around and they can tell us what's going on. Where are we and what's up? I'm listening. Okay. What's up, bro? What's the nearest stalker camp around here? I'll upload the coordinates to your PDA. Skadovsk is the only major camp around here. And... He's doing nothing and we can ask him to bring us to Skadovsk, but he will ask us for the money. And we don't have that much, so how I'll about we walk around for a bit? Bye-bye. Mutants, okay. Skadovsk, where is Skadovsk? Ah, that thingy far away is Skadovsk. Go away. Shish. He made me. That was a self defense. Can I? Okay, as much as we can see, the mutants didn't change so much. Are there... Yes, there are actually new mutants that are not present in... Uh, uh, my god. Shadow of Chernobyl and... Clear Sky. This is Kadovsk. So... Okay. The font is kind of fluffy. I don't remember how to fix it, but I will figure it out to the next stream. Sultan wants to see you. Uh -huh. But like in first games, we can steal whatever they have here. Too busy right now. Side quests in this game. They hey, are How are you? halfway are mandatory. They are very loud. It is good to do them, but not all of them. For some quests you have uh, some modifiers, achievements that are going to appear around here. And they are going to have some effects on you and your team in the future. Hello, what brings you to our humble vessel? You're new here. That's all right. You'll settle in soon enough. You know the zone is a tough teacher. I'm Beard, the local bartender. Got any questions? You come to me. You're here. We can ask him for a job, and he's going to ask us to bring some artifacts. Sure, let's do that. We need any money. So, lots of people. Pretty much every star in the map has a side quest, and I don't really remember if... They are mandatory or not. So, what are you? A statue? Got a job for me. Information from the mercenary camp. Maybe some other time. Oopsie. Don't let the door hit you. 
Hang in there, buddy. The doc said you'll be up on your feet in a couple of days. You might as well use this time to rest up and chill. Hey, stalker, come here. I got a question for you. And they're going to give us a shit What's ton up? of quests. You wounded or suffering from radiation sickness? Yes, of course. How big? So for this guy, uh, I'll just ask him for a two mission. This is a quest that is going to stick with us till the end of the game. Oof, it costs so much to repair our crap. Luckily, what I really like about this chapter is that they have completely reworked the stash system. And the stashes that we can find, uh, they are already full. And we don't have to buy the info from other people about those stashes. But Listen up. Sultan wants to see you. I don't want to talk to the guy. He's going to give some side quest that I'm not really not really happy with doing um, okay let's just do some side quests and maybe let's not slack too much because I'd like to finish the this game sorry the text distracted me a bit I'd like to finish this game before the release of Diablo 4. Damn, he's tough. I pre-ordered Diablo 4 and from what I know, I believe I'm not wrong. Uh, Times that grass render distance is killing me. Diablo 4 is going to be available for me mm, four day before the release, and I would really like to play it on 2nd of uh, June, it is right. Where is the grass distance again? Or received some notification. Ah, Delarasha has followed. <laughs> Hello, Delarasha, and welcome. My favorite subscriber. Apply changes. First follower, yee. <laughs> nice. Happy to see you. Uh, yeah, so, and also I'll try to keep my eyes peeled for the artifacts and stashes. Hey. This is a pretty good anomaly zone to look for our first artifacts, even though our detector is very crappy, but I kind of remember where they are laying. It was somewhere in the water, we just somehow need to manage... Aha, uh -huh, it is detecting that quest thingy that we need to get. Which is halfway an artifact. But there should be another one somewhere. Hmm. We are going to get... Yes, we already do a shit ton of radiation. And this is the wrong way. What a pity. This is an artifact. Aha, uh -huh, well done. Dropped right in the water. Have you seen it swimming? This is it. But our detector is crap and he is not picking it up. Okay. Okay. Uh, so the detector has to be good enough to show you some good artifacts, to reveal them. Wow, is that a mercy emote that you have there? How do I get in, please? The 
door mechanism has been blocked from the inside. Yes, mercy emote. Nice. I didn't know there are custom emotes. Damn, do I really need to go from the other side? Okay, let me check something. I got them from an Overwatch charity event a couple of years ago. Mm -hmm. And I died. <laughs> uh, did you buy them or something? Please, oh my god. I need to get used to this physics now. Because this is completely different from first games. The movement, I mean, and whatnot. And also, I might be ahead of the train, if you know what I mean, sometimes, and uh, tell you about what is going to happen next. Altered wheel. Keep. This was once the dredge station wheel. It has now half converted into a strange artifact. No properties are notable other than active glowing and a little radioactivity. A little. Holy shit. Plus six. It is going to kill me in seconds. And also, now we see that there are three people nearby. Who are they and what do they want? Brother, listen, there is this artifact, it's got healing powers, I need it real bad, a buddy of mine is about to buy the farm from his weird sickness. Our medicine can't do crap. Uh, don't give it to him. No, I haven't you seen it, keep so... You'll remember this moment, that's for sure. Tuna. <laughs> sure, bro. Stop right there! Your weapon, don't you move. Okay. Yeah, <laughs> they're on both sides and you somehow need to be the quickest hand on the Wild West. Quit screwing around. Holster your weapon. Yeah, so they want to rob me. They're not going to do it. Show yourself. I thought you have sushi on your F2. <laughs> no, that's a bandage. <laughs> but yeah, would be nice. Imagine sushi in the zone, I don't know. Damn, the recoil is crazy. It sucks that the guy fell off. I would really like to get his loot. Because he also has vodka, which is very crucial in the beginning of the game when we don't have any money for uh, any anti-radiation stuff. Ow. Please, my god. So, where is the last one? Show yourself. Uh-huh, uh-huh. He knew when I'm going to reload. Healing here takes a while, not like in the first games. He's throwing a grenade, and they are very good at throwing grenades. Good night. Nice. Plus money. I'm going to sell this crap. Unload, unload. Which one is better? Accuracy and damage is better here. That's exactly what I'm looking for, but the condition is shit. Aha, uh -huh. I'm so over encumbered already. Come on. Ah, also. Your stamina and your, I don't know, carrying cap capability, your stamina depends on how much you eat. 
So as much as you can see, uh, it just increased when I just ate some crap. Put your weapon away, man. Shut the hell up, for you. Let me check something real quick. I'm just sometimes uh, checking my stream, maybe, I don't know, this is the first time I stream uh, two platforms at the same time and I might miss some comments maybe, but so far it seems like I see everything. Anyway, uh, let's get our money. Hello. Go ahead, there was a strange artifact at the dredge station here. Interesting, a semi-artifact. Here's your fee, I pay well for a job well done. Looks like you got a decent training. Come see me when you need a job. Okay. Boop boop. So, is there any order? I have a major customer outside the zone. Blah blah blah. What artifacts do you need? Firefly Snowflake. I don't have any of those and I'm not going to have them anytime soon. What are you? Got a job for me. I agree. I take the job for later. I believe. Ah, oh, stash. Nice. Yeah, we are going to go there with the main quest once. For now, let's just sell him this crap. He doesn't want to take it. Rip. Too damaged to be traded. Is it even worth it to repair it and then sell it? I bet not. But okay, let's sell our pistol. Let's sell one of those. 800 only. Not so much. Sell the ammo that I don't want to have. That's right. Get on out of here. And the rest we can leave in this place. This is a secure spot that no one is going to pick. Maybe or maybe not. We are going to find it out later. Vodka I'd like to keep. Two bottles, let's say. Some food I'm going to leave here. And some medicine. Okay. Very good. Uh, we are dying of radiation. <sighs> let's drink some vodka. <sighs> okay. Uh, what are other side quests do we have? Tell me about yourself. Uh, oh, is he going to cure me for free? Boy. Oh, he healed us for free. Nice. That guy gave us a job. So here, by the way, I don't know if you know or remember. This is a nimble. The guys that we saved in the very first quest, in the very first game. And here he's working as an errand boy. We can order something from him. Even an exoskeleton. 60k only. But... There is a very huge but. You cannot run in exoskeletons in this game. You need to upgrade them first. And in order to do that, uh, we need to find all the tools. And we are going to find all the tools in the second half of the game. So, changed my mind, but we can... Yeah, uh, you don't really know what is he, what is he going to deliver you. But usually those are some very decent I'm things. Exoskeleton, I'm not sure you're able to find one in this game. But okay, let's talk to the folks around. And there is someone on the very top. Can they do something? Can they give us a quest or so? I don't know, probably not. Talk to the boss. I'm more into shooting than beating guns. Okay. Dude, you seen this magpie guy? You know him? No? Well, if you come across that scumbag, feel free to put a bullet in his head. Or you can tell me where he can be found and I'll make it worth your while. If I see magpie, I'll let you know for sure what he did. Um, he's the reason why their friend is been sick there and unconscious. This is a hunter. Right? Yes. 
What kind of job do you have for me? Here's the deal, several stalkers have gone missing. Oh, this is such a nice quest with such a goofy ending with if you play it right. Um, I'll take this quest, but I'm going to finish it when I find something very cool, some cool weapon. You know why. So bloodsuckers, his supposedly bloodsuckers are kidnapping stalkers, which is very sad. Okay, what do I need to do? We have to find and track down Danila. Okay. Hello. This is a guy who leads us to Yanov. Yanov is a different location. Yanov is here. And by the way, there are only three locations in this game. Zaton, uh, Jupiter and Pripyat. But they are very big, with a lot of content on both of them. So it is forgivable that in the first game it was like 10 locations or so, or in the second game. They are hey, very bro. full of content. What? Okay. He didn't want to talk to us. What is the job? So I hit some loot in this old Zaporozhets car. But when the earthquake hit and the car fell underground, okay, he asks us to bring some stash. But this is also a tricky guy. What's your name? Snag. <laughs> sure. Okay. What do you have for me? Ah, uh, so this is a bandit representative and he want to shake down a few of Beard's stalkers. It's a real kinch, whatever that word is. Late at night, you and our guys come to the Shevchenka, which is also an abandoned ship. And before these tourists figure out what's going down, you take them for a ride. Okay, sure. Uh, I picked the quest, but now we have... If you manage to stay in one piece, that is. Uh, there are a couple of ways to deal with this quest. Do what he says, go to the beard and report this guy, and then actually do the same but to the bandits. And we can also report to the beard and then come back. So double cross everyone, I don't know. And I don't remember what is going to go, come out, out of that. So beard. Someone is, plan someone is planning to stick up a group of stalkers. Our own guys too. Whoa, man. We've got bandits multiplying like rabbits and now we are fighting amongst ourselves. I got an offer to attack the camp near Shevchenko at night. Assholes. It would actually be nice if you took up their offer. See what I'm getting at? That way I can tip my boys off so they prepare a warm welcome for our guests. I agree. Let's go. Do we need to talk to the guy again? Nah, 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 nah. Forget about it. What is the closest quest to us? Haven't I warned the stalkers? Yeah, I did. Damn, I guess I was a bit too fast. Shevchenko must be here. Yes. Uh, decide what to do, but... Okay, I have an idea. Uh, let's go and sleep till the night, because that quest is going to happen in the night. Uh, like midnight. An emission has recently occurred in the zone. The heat joins the robbers. Aha, aha.
and we need to eat something. Every time we sleep, our character gets so freaking hungry, I swear. We have no night vision. Oh, shit. But okay, let's go and shoot some bandits. Oof. Just jumped off the cliff. I didn't even see it. Those are the bandits. And I don't want to side with bandits. So I will just save the game. Just in case. And see what is going to happen. Oh, it's you, bro. So what did you and Sultan agree on? Sultan says you're planning to fleece the stalkers. Count me in. All right, let's blow this joint. We'll give it to M. Good. And? What if we just shoot the bandits in their backs? I have a grenade. Sorry, 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 sorry. I'm not your enemy, maybe. <laughs> so we need to kill the bad boys now. But where are they? I have no freaking idea. That was one. Hey. Oh. What the fuck? That's a nice gun. Cool. Very cool. I hear a wounded guy. Where is he? Oh, hi. Here, have a medkit. No. no, you're my friend. But he's still wounded. Okay. Double barrel. The gun that I went through the whole game <laughs> in the previous game. I Stash received Kazakhs, bandage, anti radiation drug. Bye. This is actually going to have some outcome when we play through the game. Huh. I guess someone snacked my weapon, but whatever, that was a crappy weapon anyway. We can go... Yes, uh, we don't have to go pistol... and assault rifle. We can just go two main weapons at once. Which I find to be a very good upgrade since the first game. About we also check the stash real quick, but holy shit, is our energy going down? I don't know if it is on top or on the bottom, so let's just go on top. No, it's not on top, okay. And stash, stash, stash. Where is it? Don't tell me it is on top. Oh no, I need to get on from the other side.
Okay. Uh, I know what I'm going to spend my money on. I need a night vision thingy. Hey, come on. Ah, there it is. Damn, it's so tricky. Mm-hmm, okay. I have wasted an energy drink on that. There it is. Nice, touch found, easy. And it is way more dark than the first games. <sighs> Have you seen it? There was another stash. Here it is. Aha! <laughs> hey, hey, boy. We have more energy drinks, but maybe I should keep them for later. quickly sell the crabs that we don't need anymore. Okay, uh, take this, and he doesn't want to have anything else. This is a pity. Oh, lots of grenades that I don't need. Three is more than enough. What are you? A statue? How do I get rid of all these broken crabs that I have uh, without cluttering everything around? Let's check what modifications we actually have right now. The technician needs vodka. Sure. Yeah, so uh, for a night vision, we probably need a different helmet and instruments. That is sad. Okay, <laughs> he can do nothing without instruments. Hey. People are swearing. No good. Okay, let's sleep. Night sucks. Funny enough, the bandits are not mad at us for killing their friends. But let's leave some food here for later. Because it waits a lot. And this thing is, by the way... Yeah, they have some booster medicine now. And it is very good. This is going to increase our carry weight for five minutes. Five minutes, Carl. This is going to have some camp protection. Yeah, okay, cool. Now we can hop in in some camp areas. I'm all ears, buddy. How are you? Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Ch -ch -ch -ch. I'm out of here. Okay, so what next? What next here is the anomaly zone. We don't have a detector. Actually, maybe we should just buy a good detector from the trader. They're going to talk to me again, right? No, 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 no. Not interested. Mm, this is a good detector, but not the best. But better than ours. Okay, whatever. Um, there is not really a big point on stocking on money. Actually, there is a point. Uh, one of those achievements that you can find in here. They are... One of the achievements is uh, collect 100,000 rubles, I believe. 
And then it says that the traders are going to give us better deals since they know the time. Kind of a reliable customer that can pay for crap. So let's go and do some quests, no? This is... we are going to go there eventually. Let's go and check the crash site. Energy drink for life. Mutant. I just ignore it. I don't know, there is no point in killing them. Hopefully they are bound to the location and not going to chase me. I see some freezes from time to time. But it is... I don't know, it shouldn't lag on my PC. If you check my specs, you will understand what I'm talking about. How once I saw on one forum, I was troubleshooting Stalker and someone said that <laughs> uh, Stalker engine is made out of clay, sticks and vodka. And this is why it has problems. And this is, by the way, is a chemistry slash gravity anomaly area. We can try to first find some artifact in there and I already see one swimming in the water. And second, uh, we can eat that thingy. It has 60 second, uh, 60 second camp protection. Let's go. Give me something good. Here it is, nice. Plus artifact, there is another one. Oh, we better don't step there. Show yourself. Ow. Nice, plus artifact. Nice, 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 nice. Plus money. The only problem is that such toxic areas, they are breaking our suit very fast. And before we examine this helicopter, let me show you something what speedrunners do. Uh, yeah, let me explain. You can skip the cutscene. The cutscene is going to play. We are going to play the cutscene anyway. But if you throw a grenade under your feet and then start inspecting, the grenade is going to kill... All the electronics inside burned out. Even the power cable sheaths melting. Okay. <laughs> Never mind, I fucked up the timing. And it actually kicked me. I want to try it again. Either my grenade was not par powerful enough, or I fucked up the timing. Okay, so throw the grenade and examine. All the electronics inside Whatever. Out. Even the power cable sheaths melted. The NPCs that we see, the NPCs that we see, Kek, in the cutscene is actually not the main character, but a separate NPC that the game creates to display from, you know, third person. And it can be killed, and the moment it is killed, uh, the cutscene is over. So, no more artifacts for us. Is there anything for minus radiation? No, everything is plus radiation, which is very sad. Okay, we are going to sell it. Oof. Okay, another antidote. And let's try to make it out alive. And I really like how the water is curving. Because there is some gravitation anomalies around. It's just, oof. Such a nice design decision. But now our armor is just as tough as the wet toilet paper. Uh-huh. No, not a stash. <laughs> uh-huh. So we are going to be here later in the game.
For now, where do we go? Here we also will need to go eventually. This is that. Ah, missing hunter. And here we will go, and here we will go. I don't know where to go first. Okay, let's just go whoop, counterclockwise. Let's go and check the missing stalker. That place, we better don't go there yet. We are going to visit it eventually. We can run through, why not? But we will not stick here for too long. Because there is also, top left corner, the ice symbol and the scale next to it represent if someone can see you, someone hostile. So we better don't mess around here too much. So also, I believe there are some dogs to fight. Sh Shorty, it's your time now. And missing stalker. Oof. I think I That's found not. Get over here, ASAP. Uh huh. I will definitely get over here, but first I'd like to check this anomaly area. Because I'm convinced we can find some artifacts around here. The only problem is, where is it exactly? Is it on top or on the bottom? I save here and jump on the bottom first. Aha, uh -huh, I saw it. No! Nice. There's another one, but that one is probably on top at this point. Ow, ow. Yep, it is on top, ow. The dogs. I see something. <gasps> I know what is this. It is another side quest that I didn't pick up. It is a very long term side quest. Such a weird tree. How do I get on top, bruh? <laughs> Rip. Quick load. Quick load simulator. Let's hope the artifact is not dropping down. Nice. No, please. Oof. Rip. I'm okay. Nothing I'm at kid cannot fix. So somewhere around here something was shimmering. Here. A skeleton with a gas mask and a PDA. What is it? We are going to find out later. I'm but going to explain it to you. So I'm not going to walk around the topic. And I'm just going to spill it out. What the fuck was your problem? Holy shit. Luckily they died fast. Um, that PDA that we found, that technician on Skadovsk, he lost his friends and he's very sad about that. And he was supposed to ask me to find his friends yeah, so that was one of his friends. I saw a bloodsucker enter the building. I'm guessing that's their lair. 
But let's put that theory to the test. Watch the shadows. They could appear from anywhere. Okay. Sneaky beaky leg. Did you hear that? Never mind. Yes. I must be hearing things. Ah, classic in-game logic. There's something there. Cover me. No problemo. There are definitely some stashes around, but I guess we're going to be here again. Even if not, not a big deal. Okay, we made a full circle now. There it is. are very invisible in this chapter. Ow. Little help? Look at this. It's probably the only way of getting in the basement. Let's go and check your basement, your dungeon. Well, jumping down is the only way. Follow me. Bye. Sure, I will. Just one sec, please. Quickly sniff around. Maybe there is some supply. Eat. Your footsie Eat. still intact. Let's check out this basement then. Zara, by the way. Two ways to complete this quest. I mean, if we fail that quest, we are going to see it in the outro. I don't know when we uh, finish the game. Oh, a stash. What kind of grenades? Let's Look go. At the claw marks. Strange. Only problem is that it is impossible to get out. Yeah, those are the stashes from this game. Whatever, I'll just let it be. Some Not dead unlucky bastard. Didn't have those. At least those guys are going to share some ammo with us. The hunter isn't here. Let's go. Ooh, nice pistol. And nice grenade. Nice weapon! Please, hold your applause. Now, let's take a look inside. Let's go. Shh. It's full of sleeping bloodsuckers. Let's try to get by them without making any noise. Okay. <laughs> Pretty.
Damn, my gun is way too shiny. Holy crap. Phew. We made it. And didn't even disturb their... Energy drinks. Nice. Much respect for energy drinks. Very handy. This looks like an exit. Jump. Oh. Bad idea. Because the mission is still there. And the guy is going outside. So let's hope he's not going to die. Um, two ways to finish this quest. First, uh, the guy tells us to go on the bridge in this chapter. Okay, I hope you heard it. <laughs> anyway, uh, he asks us to go here to this bridge and find a can of gas and we are going to poison them all. Or additionally, you can just ignore all the instructions, go back and kill all the bloodsuckers on your own. And that is also going to complete the quest. And if we go a different way, we are going to find a stash, by the way. Ta-da! That huge thingy, by the way, is an antibiotics. If you are outside during the emission, which is deadly, you can just take it and go to sleep. Oh. We are not covered. Now we are. And now let's just wait it through. Too much of it. So I've been just thinking, going uh, here, then here. Is it plateau? Yes, it is a plateau. Sucks, because we cannot get... It's very spooky outside. Uh, to get on plateau, we need to talk to Noah that lives here, but yeah. This is something for later. I was thinking about going here, then picking up the chest, but the chest weights like 20 freaking kilos. 20! And we are pretty full of stuff already, 47. On 50 kilos, we will start losing our stamina by just breathing, I don't know. Oh, nice mask, by the way. And all those things. So health restoration, cool, but Stalkers, I would put it. Is over. I hope you're all in one piece. So the best things are the ones that are giving you plus maximum weight and stamina, because they make you more mobile. The rest is meh. Not so good, profitable, whatever. Energy drink, power. I'm still losing my stamina too fast. Way too fast. And by the way, some people decided that in such places, like next to the tree with bushes, they often put some crap in the bushes, and you never know that there's something inside. Unless you have a data about that. I mean, makes sense, right? That's what it's all about. Secret stash is supposed to be secret. By the way, I'm going to stop the stream 5-10 minutes. Uh, I actually wanted to stream earlier today, but I could
could not. Ooh. 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 Hi. And I see an artifact over there. And there is, by the way, another friend of that guy in those caves underground. Uh, yeah, so the plan is we come back to Skadovsk, we talk to the guy and pick up the quest from him. Ah, people will manage without me. And um, talk to the beard. I slipped. I didn't even move. What the fuck? And the beard is going to tell us to go to the bridge. I bet my ass on that. Hey guys. So. Hello. Hello. I found the whole bloodsucker layer underneath the antenna complex. Okay, the layer must be wiped out. Let me think a second. Who the hell knows how many bloodsuckers were? There are in those tunnels, like 10. <laughs> uh, maybe we could cast them instead. I remember Al saying something about gas tanks. You talk to him, we are not on very good terms. Okay. Gas tanks are on the bridge. Okay, I'll do that. And I will help you to deal with the bandits. Great. Go to the ranger station. That's where our boys are. They'll give you uh, all the details. What artifacts do you need? Firefly bubble eye. An eye. What is an eye? Do I have it? Night Star, Stone Blood, Meat Chunk. Night Star I keep for myself. But those ones. Oh, what is that? Kolobok. <laughs> okay. Kolobok. Drop in if something interesting comes up. Let's talk to the technician. Uh, so sometimes he is just mentioning his friends. Tell me about Joker and Parch. Yeah, I came to the town with two of my buddies, Barge and Joker, young kids full of peace and vinegar, itching to get their hands on mountains of artifacts, dying to be the first, the fastest. And I looked at those burning eyes and I said to myself, that ain't gonna do them no good. Loot's nice to have, sure, but it ain't worth charging headlong into a mutant's jaws. So what happened? Well, we were hanging out one night drinking and started arguing over what to do next. Should we go on or stay? And if we go, where to? Everyone sticking to his gun standing pat. Things got pretty heated and then the argument was over. We all went our own ways. Me included. I told them blah 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 and I miss them and I cry every night in my pillow. And I found the PDA of his friend. I have found this PDA, have a look. What do I need a PDA for? Whose is it? I found it near some bare bones not far from Oak Pine, which is that uh, anomaly area. It's Joker's PDA. Joker's? That's impossible. Wow, I'm so devastated. Joker is dead. Oh, Joker, we won't be laughing at your jokes anymore. Rest in peace. I hope Barge is all right at least. <laughs> no, but he doesn't know it yet. Okay, uh, let's hide some stuff for later. And let's try to get rid of some stuff. I need information. I need poison gas. 2000, what the fuck is your problem? But okay. Here. Listen, once there was a military motor column here transporting gas which didn't make it. No one knows what happened. But the gas tanks should be still there. All clear? Yeah, there might be some documents here too. If you find them, bring them to me and you just might recoup your investment. He doesn't want to take my mask. This is very sad. 
<laughs> Inventory management, let's go. Okay, so. And let me guess where the gas tank is. Pam pam pam. Right at the That's bridge. Right. Get on out of here. The medic disappeared. This is strange. Hmm. Why did he do that? Maybe he has some shady business on the side. Hmm? Let's find out. I'm still working on that container. Okay, uh, where to next? Do we go clockwise now? Do the trader have, or has, does he have a scope? Yes, he does. 1000 only, okay. I have an idea. How about we try to mount the scope to our AK, which we need to upgrade first. Optical mount. Yes. And now put a scope on the gun. Amazing. Perfect. Hey, stalker. How are you? And? And, 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 and. Oh, nice. That is going to make my life <clears throat> quite easier. Oh, some dead folks. Oh, yeah. Your weapon I'm not interested in, but your stuff? Who killed them? I don't want to take the armor. They're not really profitable to, say, uh, to sell. Go to this guy. Aha, uh -huh, here you are. Wonder who is fighting who? As far as they're not fighting me, I'm okay. Another dead bandit. Another dead bandit. Probably bandits and stalkers are fighting again, but okay. I'm just going to. Ooh. Hey. Some dead bandit. Took a weapon from him. <laughs> you ink. Ow. Got numbed. So many dead bandits I see on the minimap, but whatever. Or not whatever. What if we, what if they have some artifacts that I can sell? Oh, that's a stalker. This is who was fighting. But okay, I'm not going to take more vodka. Another stalker. Oh, cool, some nice ammo. It's cringe to buy ammo in stalker, if you didn't know. And this is why you're going to see me doing that. Uh, if you give him vodka, he will make a discount. Shit, sorry, I have missed uh, your comment. Does him give a discount? I believe he's only unlocking some uh, upgrades that he cannot make without any vodka. And why did you decide to run the channel in English? <sighs> Simply because English is my first language. I guess this is why. I speak English on a regular basis. So I don't know if you still hear <laughs> my reply after such a long time, probably. Really, I apologize. Got a bit carried away. So yeah, let's meet our fellow stalkers. And... Sucks. Now they have to finish what they started here. Ow. Let's hope they're immortal. And discount too. Oh shit, I didn't know. Okay, next time. 
next time I'm here. Cool. Oh, he just lost two of his buddies and he completely ignoring everything around him. Okay, bro. Damn, they killed one of ours. Shit. But okay, have a med kit. Alright, yo. So, Ata boy, thanks for coming. We want to sneak up close to the bandits and listen in. Then we'll see what happens. We better prepare a grenade. <laughs> in the beginning. Trust me. And maybe we also need to be sneaky. What have you got? Show me. Look. We've got these here artifacts, and we can get more of them. In exchange, we're looking for weapons and some good equipment. You know that I've got whatever duty's got, so weapons and equipment are not a problem. All my stuff is top quality, no doubt about it. Well, that clears things up. Take them down. I'm Ukrainian and I thought you speak Ukrainian as first language because you speak with an accent. Yeah, I know that. I mean, I've been speaking English uh, for the last two years. Really? Ah, shit, I wounded our own guy. Uh, yeah, like no jokes. Uh, I don't live in Ukraine for the last three years and... Uh, my first language is English at this point, because everything I do, my job, my uh, everything, my everyday life is in English. So yeah, it is what it is. Але я все ще можу розмовляти українською, та іноді я це роблю. But my Ukrainian is a bit rusty at this point. Well, that 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 is that is is так конечно. Правда, іноді я розмовляю з суржиком, тому що я зі східної України. Я шифруюся. Бля, я вас лет. So the last folks, where are they? Oh shit. Okay. Oh. The recoil, holy shit, I'm like a Rambo with those... Where is it? No. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Is he fat? Bruh. Ay, 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 ay. Keep everything. Easy now. Here's the medkit. Drop. What was that? Are those bad guys shooting or are those good guys shooting? I just don't know if I should intervene or not. I guess since they are not really uh, doing something next to me, I can just ignore it. Question mark. But all the meds I'm going to take. And sausages. 
Sausage is life. Okay. Thank you, Stalker. Take this from us. Barman's got your main reward. I see. Oh, a stash right here. Nice. Okay, those folks are going to deal with each other. Ooh, ooh, baby, look at this. Mm. No. Yeah. Oof, did he throw a grenade at me? Anyway, I also want to find out what is cheaper to put a scope mount on this AK or repair this AK because it is so broken at this point and I wonder how did I manage? Anyway, uh, let's go back. Let's get our reward and I guess I go because in 40 minutes I have to leave and before the time I still have some things to do. And I guess I have enough ammo for now. I don't know, you say. Sorry, just get some random notifications on my phone. Hello. Okay, beard. What brings you to our humble vessel? I spoiled the bandit's weapon transaction. Oh, thanks for helping out. I think back to the 90s and it's thugs with RPGs. I'd like to have one, by the way. And just shudder. Here, take this. Cash is always good to have. What artifacts do you need? Firefly. Do I have a Firefly? Well, I guess not, because I believe I sold everything. Yes, I did. Okay, boss. You. You might be interested. Morgan's PDA. Information about the duty trader who sells weapons left and right. Got to be useful for something. I'll pay for some deal. I don't need it. This I sell. This I sell. Mm, and this I sell. And are you okay if I will write in Ukrainian? I can write in both. Sure, totally. I'm totally okay. fine. But are you okay with me talking English? Do you understand me? Repair. Okay. And scope mount. <laughs> the same price, whatever then. Oh damn, I should have... Got some boost. Want a shot? Here's to a steady hand. <laughs> and let's see if he's giving me a discount. No. Repair? Yes, he does. Not a big discount, but still, good to know. Unload, detach scope. I leave it here. Okay. Just a little bit of inventory management here. Dump some stuff that we don't really need. We don't need 10 sausages, even though I really like sausages. Grenades also. Some medkits for later. I cannot... Okay, I also dropped some ammo because I would really like to drop under 30 kilos. Okay, nice. Graf Stalker in Chernobyl. Конечно. Of course I played it. Uh, this is one of my favorite games. Uh, I don't know, Stalker, uh, Shadow of Chernobyl and Clear Sky, they have such a place such a special place in my heart i from time to time replay those games and damn the last time i played all the stalkers through in 2018 it was okay and also like 
Uh, Fallout 3, Fallout New Vegas. Those are my absolutely favorite games. Okay. I play some music. And I guess I'm about to leave. Я так само переграв всі частини багато разів. <laughs> Я також грав у різні модифікації. Але я не знаю. Не зачепилось якось. <laughs> so, uh, I would be happy to see you again on my stream next week probably because tomorrow at the time where i usually stream i have a dentist appointment and uh, friday i leave saturday sunday i'm not available so probably next monday i'm going to stream and by the way that was the very first stream uh, on twitch hey so okay well maybe uh, you can drop a follow and then you will definitely not miss me going live. If you want. So this is it for today. Then I guess see you on Monday. Thank you a lot for watching. Thank you a lot for participating. Hey, Kanandri is now following. Amazing. My second subscriber on Twitch or follower, sorry. Then guys, thank you a lot again and see ya again on Monday. Bye bye.